And you've been watching a special report, a daily update on the statewide spread of and fight against COVID-19. Uh, we first heard from Governor Wolf. He mentioned that there's now a hospital emergency loan program, which is $450 million, which will allow facilities uh, the appropriate equipment that they need to fight the COVID-19 pandemic. And he also, the governor also had a strong message of staying home this holiday weekend to prevent any spread. And uh, to further emphasize his point, he gave an example of a, a case where there was actually one person that uh, infected dozens of others. And uh, some of our state totals we heard, uh, we now have 416 deaths, uh, 1,700 new positive COVID-19 cases, which brings our state total now to 20,000 cases. And of those, uh, 955 are in health care workers. So as of this afternoon, here are the latest on the confirmed cases of coronavirus near us. Right now, there are a total of 37 confirmed cases of COVID-19 in Erie County. Crawford reports 13 cases. Warren County has one case. There are 22 confirmed cases reported in Chautauqua County, New York, and two deaths, and 19 confirmed cases in Ashtabula County, Ohio. Across Pennsylvania, there are nearly 20,000 positive cases of COVID-19. 416 people have died and more than 93,000 people have tested negative. So what should you do? The best advice, stay calm, stay home, and wash your hands often. And practice social distancing of at least six feet. And Jet24 carries a live digital exclusive coronavirus newscast daily at 11.30 a.m., 3 p.m. and 9 p.m. on our website, yourerie.com. And we'll have a complete wrap-up tonight on Jet24 beginning at 5 p.m. And we are live every night at 7 p.m. on Facebook. Thank you for joining us. I'm Brian Wilk. Good afternoon. This has been a Jet24 Fox 66 special report.